For money and power, glory and greed, man will die, man will bleed. Yeah. stay hungry it's a form of consistency motivation and never lack hunger I've been hungry and I stay hungry in the sense that even when you don't have nothing you don't settle for less as I always say when you're on ground zero the only way to look is up so you keep on achieving you keep on achieving and I've been fortunate enough to be around some successful people in mind and they never lack a sense of ambition and hunger. So to stay hungry is just about maintenance, consistency, never losing the hunger, the king of the jungle, you know, making sure that your dominance is known and people approach you with caution because they know when they're dealing with you, they're dealing with someone who's ambitious, determined, you know, they have commitment to their cause and that's what Stay Hungry represents. It's important to stay humble because it's in many biblical terms. Many men before us taught us to remain humble. You can relate. And as I said, your wealth is in character, not in material objects because you can't take nothing with you. So it's nice to acquire things and try and create heaven on earth. But at the end of the day, you can't take it with you. So it's good to just stay relatable. And I think stay humble in a sense means I'll always approach the man on the street with the same respect as the man with the house on the hill. It's an equal playing field. Stay humble isn't such a meaning where it's like be weak, um, bow down when you're spoken to. That's not what humble means. Stay humble is just about treating the person on the street with the same respect as you treat the person with the man up the hill. Because at the end of the day, everyone's got a story and you can take inspiration from both. Even though stay hungry and stay humble are so different in the sense of stay hungry is about being fearless, ferocious, um, consistent, ambitious. Stay humble seems to be very timid, relaxed, quiet, respectful, bow down. But the meaning of the mixture is you have to achieve, you have to be ambitious, but you don't want to be so boisterous that you can't connect to people and you only want to connect to a certain class of people. So stay humble means treat the person who is beneath you in a different class to the same person who's above you in a different class.